Welcome to another Super Deluxe Edition unboxing video. Today we're going to take a look at the complete Polydor years, level 42, 1985 to 1989. So this of course follows up the 1980 to 1984 box which came out earlier on this year. And pleased to say it's very consistent in terms of the packaging. It's exactly the same kind of size box and it's got the same inner sliding drawer. Of course the difference is this is black and that one's white. But as you can see there, everything looks pleasingly consistent. It's going to look good on the shelf. How are you going to resist that? So it's very good to see this kind of attention to details because, of course, not everyone goes for the uh, consistency approach. Exhibit number one, Duran Duran. First album, lift off lid box. Second album, hey, let's make this a little book pack. Let's write 2 CD limited edition on the front of the cover. Exhibit number 2, REM, out of time. Let's do it as a nice little book set like that. Great. Yeah, but let's follow up with a massive hardcover, large format, automatic for the people box set. And let's follow that with this little weird book set for um, Monster. So yeah, not everyone gets consistency, but I'm glad to say the team at Cherry Red who have put this together certainly do so yeah as i say it's the same kind of approach it's got 10 cds just like the last one so let's take a look at them first of all actually let's have a quick look at the booklet um really like how this is laid out in terms of the overall approach nice job attention to detail original design elements there's some um interviews there with the band so yeah really nice job with this in terms of the discs so the first two are the live album physical presence this was released in june 1985 this is the full version across two cds because originally it was a edited version on one disc and then there was a long play cassette and a double album so obviously that's good news I won't get every CD out because I think they all look like this. Yes, there we go. There's the second CD there. Now, of course, the same year, 1985, in September, I think it was, World Machine came out. So this was a bit of a breakthrough for Level 42 because it was a big record for them. Uh, Something About You is obviously on this album, uh, along with Leaving Me Now. I remember having the cassette of this, which had the on the B on the flip side of the cassette, there was loads of uh, remixes. It was like a limited edition. I think it might have been an HMV exclusive. Actually, I can't remember. But that's sort of how I first really got into Level Forty Two. So yeah, so that's that's the album. Obviously, if you're wondering about bonus material, it's all on separate discs at the end. So we'll get to that. Next up, the very big album, Running in the Family. This is a massive record for the band. In fact, there was platinum editions and all sorts of special editions at the time. Of course, the lead single, Running in the Family, was a big hit. As was Lessons in Love, It's Over. Great record. Now, the final album. So there's only actually three studio albums and the one double live album. But the five, the final album here is Staring at the Sun. So this was 1988. Running in the Family was 87. The, the hits, I wouldn't say the hits dried up or anything, but uh, they didn't have the big top 10 hits that they had before. I think Heaven in My Hands was the uh, biggest hit from this one. But then the juicy part of the box set is next. So all the bonus discs. So this is, first bonus disc is 7-inch singles. Obviously it was a big thing at the time, having a 7-inch remix. So to help the song along in the chart, try and get a bigger hit. So it's all the original 7-inch remixes here, of all the various singles this um, includes something about you leaving me now running in the family to be with you again it's over blah 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 they're all there next disc is the b-sides i mean they've done the same thing as before they've recreated the artwork from various singles which is always a nice touch yes yeah, so these are the various b-sides there are still a couple of remixes actually because something about you the u.s remix edit was a b-side it's an instrumental of it's over, another remix of Star Child. So, but there's some live things on there as well. Now then, this is what we came for, 12 inch singles and remixes. The trouble with level 42 is a lot of them have been out before, but the ADSC mix of To Be With You Again is notoriously 
incorrect on various reissues but this is the correct version this time so that's good lots and lots of remixes Shep Pettibone instrumentals dubs blah 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 and then a second disc of remixes because there's so many so this is a slightly later period but uh, it's got heaven in my hands a couple of remixes there a couple of remixes of take care of yourself it's over extended remix and as if that wasn't enough there's a disc at the end which is a sort of mopping up exercise called bonus tracks and so there's more remixes on here and various ad hoc things there's the platinum edition mega mix which may be of interest there's shep's final mix of lessons in love the um, HTL dub of Running in the Family, whatever that is. World Machine, live at Hammersmith, Leaving Me Now, live at Hammersmith. Something About You, live at Hammersmith. Three live tracks. So they're the bonus tracks there. So these are all spined sleeves there, you can see. They all slot nicely back into that inner drawer there. The uh, booklet goes there. And then in we go. So um, as before, great value, 50 quid. You can't really complain. A wonderful job by the guys putting this together. The first box set got lots and lots of praise, and I imagine this one will as well. The two together obviously represent you know, the classic era, the 1980s for level 42. So it's a wonderful pairing. Um, if you've got the first box, you basically have to buy the second box. It's the law. Yeah, great job. This is the complete Polydor years, level 42, 1985 to 1989. If you've enjoyed this unboxing video, why not subscribe to the SDE YouTube channel for more great physical music unboxed. But thanks very much for watching and I'll see you next time.